After choosing Uganda as your next destination, you'll need a place to sleep and where to get food from. So of those two, I'm going to help you solve one. We are going to solve the place where you're going to sleep and that place is going to be right where we are. Welcome to this amazing furnished apartment, so Airbnb right here in the heart of Kampala. Uh, the apartment is located in Muyenga, very good neighborhood, secure, 24-hour security, and you can access each and everything just within a walking distance. We have a supermarket right there, we have shops right there, the road is just like one minute walk from the main road, so it's easily accessible and let me show you around. Hello, it's Fanny and this is our budget uh, friendly Airbnb also here in Muyenga and uh, for this one it's a three bed, three bath, however you have the option to just reserve a room and have the common space. The common space is basically this which is the living room for the lounge and the kitchen. So for this particular one, all the rooms are self-contained. You have your bed in your room, you have your workstation in your room, you have your bathroom and toilet in your room. So it's only when you need to come out to cook or to chat with friends, that's when you can come and use these common areas. So there are three bedrooms, so we have two bedrooms available for guests. So you can choose between the two. The only difference between the two is that one is bigger and spacious than the other but all of them have everything and suite so let me show you the common space the common space is the living area the tv and um, there's a little dining space here if you want to and then here is the kitchen and um, right from the kitchen as you can see there are staff here so probably there are guests currently here so i'll show you the common space and also there is a space for laundry where you can just do laundry you can see someone is doing laundry right here and um yeah so all the rooms are entry and the difference in pricing of the rooms is just based on their sizes and what some of them offer and then one has already tv installed hopefully with time by the time you come you'll find another tv installed and then beside that we have high speed internet right here if you need internet you just have to connect everyone to get to use it and then this is the available hallway it's pretty large as you can see one of the rooms is there and then the other one is down there so you can see there is a lot of space in between them. So walking in, this is your amazing living room with an AC in case it is hot, the temperature is high, you can just turn it on and then chill and relax. We have amazing uh, rustic style furniture in the sitting room. You can sit here and relax and have an amazing time. And then right also beside we have HD TV fully connected to the internet, you can watch Netflix, you can browse whatever you want and also we have high speed fiber internet right here for your convenience so you can you're able to connect with your loved ones, you're able to work even from here if you work online and we have everything set up for you so right from the living area I'll walk you right to the four sitting dining area and the dining area is simple and just you can sit here and have your food and then right here we have a little bar area which doubles down as also your work area you can sit here and just do your work from here or even have a cup of drinks if you would like to you just sit and chill right here so besides that uh right from the Right from the dining, you have a very huge hallway, as you can see. We are going to head there in a few minutes. But before that, let me take you to the kitchen. So the kitchen is fully equipped for your convenience. We have all the cutleries you need. We have water, uh, percolator, we have uh, wine glasses, we have the blender, and then we have here 
three gas and one electric cooker plus oven as well so gas is already put for you and then uh, more utensils are all up here and then right this way we have a fully functional microwave and then a large fridge here and here is a little pantry where you can store your food and everything and then uh, before we leave the kitchen there is actually a washing area or laundry area so it's just here you can just do your laundry right from here at your convenience right all right so now you've seen the living area i'll take you to the bedrooms this particular one is a three bedroom three bathroom apartment however we also have options for two bedrooms one bedroom in this exact same location maybe we shall do a tour next time but for now let me show you this three bedroom apartment so walking through the hallway we have the first bedroom which is right here and this bedroom doubles down with a little workstation. You can just sit here, close this seat, sit and work from here. And you can see there's a mirror right there. And also there is a wardrobe or storage for you to just store your clothes or belongings right here. So this is the bedroom, it's so spacious and it has a large window. If you need fresh air, you can just open it up to get enough fresh air. So from the first bedroom, let me just take you right to the second bedroom, which is just across it. And uh, for this particular bedroom, you can see it's a little bit larger than the other one. It also has enough storage for you that you can use. And also it has a little workstation. You can just sit here and work. And then there's an extra storage right there. You can put your suitcases down here or even grab that seat and just walk from here. And then one important thing about this particular bedroom is that it has a bathroom and toilet attached to it. So you can actually just enter and shower right from here. So looking at it, the bed is simple and you have your side tables right next to you. You've already seen the two bedrooms and one of the bathrooms. So let me show you another one. So this is another bathroom and toilet. You can use this for your guests or even the person using the first bedroom can actually use this toilet. And there is a shower right here. You can just enter and take your shower and it has got hot water. As you can see, there is a water heater in this particular shower. So yeah, this is your second bathroom and toilet. So now let me take you to the next bedroom, which is the, what we call the master bedroom. For the master bedroom, we understand that uh, the king, the master has AC right here in this particular bedroom. There's AC in case it is hot, you feel free to control. By the way, all rooms have mosquito repellents. You may be wondering why I'm not seeing mosquito nets, but every room we provide you with mosquito repellents, like you see this in the socket. So you just turn it on in case there are mosquitoes. And then the bed is there with beautiful side tables for you. And for this particular bedroom, it has got really a beautiful uh, chair. You can just sit here and relax anytime you want and then also this master bedroom has a balcony you can just put this chair out there and then just relax and so this also has a very good mirror you can see the mirror is really cute you can look at yourself this is a dressing mirror and dress right from here besides that there's really this massive wardrobe or storage where you can store where you can store your stuff. We have hangers available for you. There's a flat iron here if you need to iron. And um, lastly is the master bathroom and toilet. So this is the toilet and then it doubles down with a shower as well, which is right here. And then also this 
shower has got a heater, so there is hot water here if you need hot water, and this is readily available for you to just carry your suitcases and then just walk right in and start life right away. So this is the entire house tour of a three bedroom, three bathroom apartment here in Muyenga. It's ideal for those coming in groups, also for families. Uh, if you're more than two, three people, you can come and live in this space. I'm readily available to welcome you. So after the tour, I'm asking, what, how do you bridge the gap between the Airbnb and the airport like how do people like if someone is coming from outside how do they get to the airbnb is there a way you help them here or they solve that problem for themselves and then they find themselves here at the place uh, all right so if you need airport pickup after booking the place we can organize for you a driver to pick you out from the airport which is very discounted for our guests it's not a normal airport rate as the one you will find at the airport so we have a particular driver with a seven seater car that can get you even if you are alone he will always be there and at discounted rate for our guests uh, besides that some guests have people who are ready to pick them up so in case you have someone to pick you up then well and good we just coordinate to you send you the location and then you'll come and find us right here I'll be available to welcome you personally uh, in this space and um, we've, host you. We've seen the kitchen. Like, for someone who doesn't know how to cook, do they have the provision of getting a professional chef or they can now buy food from outside? All right, so if you're someone who doesn't want to cook and you want to have food, uh one you can get food from outside secondly the whole reason for the kitchen is for your convenience so that you're able to cook your own food and all that so if you need professional chef we can get you that but that will be at your own cost yeah as a host we don't provide that service but uh, if you need it we can help you just get the person and then you work with that person to um, cook for you and still about travelers some travelers tend to move alone, like say a giant has moved alone. Mm. Uh, yes, we've seen the washing area. Like if someone can't operate those machines, is there a person or a helper that will help them like do the laundry or? All right, so first off, um, the day you check in, we have a house guide. It is an e-copy yeah. that we provide to the guests. And in that house guide, we state that if you need help, using any of those things you let us know and if you can't operate any of these things we have someone a caretaker that lives within the property and is always available to assist you anytime if you need help with using the appliances and besides that when you're checking in normally we show you how to use the the things uh for example uh like lighting up the gas cooker sometimes people find challenges with it so we show you how to do it and anytime you find a challenge you can just get in touch with a um, housekeeper which also we have contacts of in the house guide when you check in so we give you a house guide all you need is to just read through it and all the frequently asked questions and also some contacts of immediate help if you need if you need delivery we actually have contacts of a delivery driver that okay. is available to help you with deliveries picking up staffs within all that so even if you are a local and you just want like a space to spend your weekend in we welcome you okay yeah you also host birthday parties or what uh for parties uh we don't unless uh just for the sake of noise because this is really a quiet place yeah. and if you bring in parties kind of it might disrupt the neighborhood or the neighbors you know so this is a pretty quiet place and if you're having a party then it has to be a silent party there is a noise level limit okay yes so you can have your silent party as long as you're not too loud that someone else has to complain yeah, I know some people be like, these areas, this is Muyenga. Yes. Some people be like, yo, that is an area for the rich. 
but I think according to what they've told me the prices are very affordable just link up just check up the links in the comments sorry in the description below and make sure you follow up and look out for this and this is goes to all the people that are abroad that are planning to come back I have my people in the US I have my people in the UK mm -hmm. those people are planning to come back for the holidays because it's never late to plan earlier and then this would be a nice place imagine if you're like two people you and your wife you've been working from abroad and you don't want to be next to the family of course sometimes the family members are too much they'll be mm -hmm. like they'll give you a lot of headache you need to have some time away i think this would be the perfect spot and you get away from the noise yes. that would be my advice for the people that are planning to come back for the festive seasons of course we are left with only two months, two months. three yeah and that time will be coming. Yeah. So this would be the perfect time, so, so the perfect place. And with all that said, you'll be in the rich man's woods of Moyenga Bokasa. That is the most important thing. That will give you the value of your money. So I think let's end the video just right here. From me and her, we say bye-bye. See you.